Saturdays for the boys in fixing cars. I don't know, man. I don't know if I trust this kid, but he says he can get the E30 breathing and moving. So we're going to try to drive, uh, drive it down to 3rd Street today. And then, then the next step is maybe clean it, I guess, or something. I tried to clean it, and then he yelled at me. <laughs> so it's dirty, basically, because of that. Hey, where are we going, left or right? Right. right. Get on 50 to Watt. Oh, so we go all the way to Watt and then yeah. cut it again? Okay, cool. We're going for a little adventure. A little? Oh. Things didn't take a lot of work. Big adventure? I'm just kidding. it's tiny. It's tiny? It's, well, perfect size. Tiny, tiny. tiny. It's, it's a perfect, perfect size. size perfect work, size. Boys. It's a perfect size. Should be quick. Uh, so the first thing we're trying to get it to move downtown uh, So we just need to get it to roll. So I think we need the what the slave solenoid slave slave cylinder cylinder you That's pretty good. I just know yeah. it's the clutch because it won't stiffen you need a stiff clutch and our shits wonky, right? It's a little flaccid. Yeah flaccid s s s s s Thing and so we got to fix that and then hopefully we're gonna pump up the tires and get her to roll but then Matt's actually good at what he does as much as I make fun of him. So he's checking all the little things, like all the little leaks. I mean, this thing hasn't moved, moved probably in three years. And it's ran probably three times in the last two years. So we're going we're gonna to wake her up, move her downtown, probably clean her. And then what? Fix the leaks. Then we perfect it from there. Yeah, and then we'll, we'll slowly chip away at it. Nothing major for a while because I need the cashola. But then we want a, a wrapper because she's so ugly on the poor paint. Interior is pretty solid. This stuff's solid-ish. So today we're just gonna replace the slave cylinder and the fuel filter, and then do a quick tune-up. And she should move, hypothetically. Yeah, a little tire um, pumpy. Cause yeah, a little tire pump. Eventually, or probably right after pump that, pump. we'll get gaskets. Whoa. Gaskets, cause th uh, leaks, and then new battery. A new battery. <laughs> yes, a new battery. And then those, that'll make it alive. And then we'll figure out how to make her pretty and cute for photo shoots. <laughs> and then we'll upgrade. Upgrade the seats, little things. Maybe the wheels, because Matt hates my wheels. Yes, the wheels need to go. The wheels need to go. You can trade them. Because it's protected by the hood? I don't know, but like normally that shit would be ratted. Look, it's all nice. I mean, it's dirty, but that looks good, right? It doesn't look too bad. It doesn't look too bad. This is dirty. It's, it's not cobwebs. like broken and ripped and shit. It's a couple cobwebs. That's yeah, it. but normally it's like broken and ripped. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's been stained. I think we got a nice framework going. You know? Mike's just trying to find compliments for his car right now. Look, he talks so much mess on this thing and then privately texts me, he's like, all right, bro, I'll buy it for 15K. I'll buy it right now. I'll buy it. Oh, let me buy it. And then he comes in person and talks shit. Who's playing the games? You're playing the games. I'm That's not true, Matt. Um, I got the receipts. You got the receipts? Yeah. I got the... The engines 8K, steering he knows wheels. What he got. Steering I wheels 800. You better hit me with the, I know what I got. The pedals bro. are 500. What else? The frame itself got to be 5 to 10K, right? Uh, clean it up a little. Bit. Yeah, but there's no rust, rust. Yeah, true, true, true. So 5 to 10K. I mean, this thing is 34 year, 33 years old. Damn. It's a 1990. For a car, damn. Yeah, for a human too. She. Um, I don't think the liquid moving. Uh, it's coming out slow. It's, it's it's super slow. Like don't you don't gotta be like keep an eye on. No, I'm it. I'm licking it every second. I just see mechanics be licking liquid. What's up with y'all in that? Uh, it just tells us what it is. I know, but there's got to be another way. Uh, oh, there definitely is. It's just like an old school thing. Like I don't know, all the old heads like to do it. Yeah, they just be tasting it's shit. Like, yeah, bro, let me get some cancer in me. Yeah, I do that with barbells. I just be licking them. I do that shit sometimes. Not the barbell one. You're what? Weird. <laughs> I just tell you what kind of barbell we're using. Uh, I'll lick some. Uh, <laughs> you don't read the end of the label. You nah. Just... All right, so we're turboing this thing or what? Eventually. Most people turbo instead of supercharge these engines. Why is that? Because uh, it's cooler. Really? Yeah. I feel like a supercharger is cooler. To them, it's cooler. Turbos are. Yeah, they make cooler sounds. <laughs> That's literally why they do it. Don't lie. You can make more power on a turbo. Okay. Thank you, you for well, a real like, answer. No, no, no. Like, for shit. real though, no, no, like, no, like, for legit, it's mostly because of factor. But unless you're really making stupid power, 
It doesn't make a difference. I don't want. I like naturally aspirated cars. Is that stupid? No, I like NA too. Yeah. Is that like a thing? Yeah. But some people like turbo shits. Yes. I'd rather have my car be slower, more reliable, and naturally aspirated. Same. Is that old head or is that just cool? No, that's normal. That's cool, right? Yeah. What could we do to this thing to give it more horses that's naturally aspirated? Uh, you just tune it, throw some better injectors, some better fuel, okay. cam, some cams, and you'll make like 50 more. All right. Maybe we do that long term. The shoes. Huh? <laughs> the shoes. <laughs> <laughs> bro, pull up those Dino ones for him real quick. This is just hot, bro. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> oh, this is good. Bro. Those are three hundred dollars shoes. Those are leather. Those are leather shoes, dog. <laughs> no one fucking knows. No, these are hot. Bro, hot. everyone, what y'all think? What y'all think? What y'all think? <laughs> Would you deadlift in these? I'm not saying go to the club in them. No, I wouldn't do anything in those, bro. I'm gonna box you in these. I'm gonna knock you out, and then I'm gonna put them on your dead, cold feet. Oh my god, that was morbid. Holy <laughs> shit. Cold and change your toes. That's crazy. Knock, hold up, knock your ass cold and change your toes? Bro, what? Hey, that's what you like, bro. Put the piston in. So I moved the main part uh, to move it so it should push. And I was like, and we weren't getting any back pressure. That's why when you were stepping on the pedal, yeah, yeah. Nothing. nothing was happening because this is actually the master cylinder it's shot busted. out. It's busted. Because, but that was busted too. Yeah, yeah. So busted, busted. I'm gonna price both right now, and that means just this to go. What's that whole cost? Fifty bucks. Can we get it today? <laughs> Nowhere. Saturday. Uh, yeah, but car, car shops. Oh, looks like what we need. What do you just call these hoes? Call me in the ring. As um. Have it. I saw it online, but it's a one-day delivery, so I was wondering if you could search it. Um, if there's any stores locally, I can get it. Um, I don't have the part number, but it's a, a BMW, uh, BMW E30, a 1990, a 325IS, and I'm looking for a master cylinder. For the brakes? Yeah. Yeah, I saw online you guys can get it like by tomorrow by 1 p.m. But I'm wondering if there's somewhere I can pick it up today. So it does not look like there's going to be any other availability anywhere else. It's coming to my distribution center in Stockton. Gotcha. And there's no way, yeah, there's nowhere to pick it up. I check this gas leak because gas pump really? is it nothing big. I call it perfect size. I know. I don't know why you say that, but that's because you have a small D. Hey, 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 we don't use those terms nowadays, brother. It's called perfect size. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah, $100 fixing it back. Let's back this thing. We get it tomorrow or whenever you're home and get it. Yeah. I ain't that mad. Yeah. Because uh, he works at EU Tech and they, they can ship it in for like Monday. Try to start it. We'll check for the fuel. Make sure fuel leak is fixed. Hot take. BMWs oh. are better than Honda Civics. Oh. Hot take. <laughs> Further assessment, this car will not move today. I am a little bummed, but we went ahead and replaced the slave cylinder and the fuel filter that was leaking. It does have a leaky line down there, but that's like not a big worry. The only thing that's not gonna move today because the master cylinder is leaking, causing it to lose pressure. So we are not getting any clutch feedback due to that. Uh, not mad at it. I would just say old car problems. You know, you neglect a car for seven years, ten years, and uh, stuff happens. So I recommend drive your cars and not let it sit for 15 years. And they will probably do better than this. But I will say, uh, it does run good, idles good. Oh, don't worry about that. <laughs> don't worry about that. But uh, I'm happy with what we got. We should be able to get it run ASAP. Just get it uh, dialing in the mix and carries, and hopefully, yeah, get this thing to run ASAP Rocky. No fur. How do you feel about that, Mikey? That millennial. I only sat for three years because I had to build <laughs> the gym that this guy now enjoys. So my money and time went elsewhere. I've only owned the car for five or six years, and yes, I neglected it, but 
He also talks a lot of mess, but he loves this thing already. And he's only spent two days with it, so. She's gonna live, she's gonna, we're gonna make it nice and pretty. Wait to see more come in. It's time to eat, you can show them the food too. Show them how we eat around here. I stole this hat, my mom's going through all my old shit. And this one, my old Jordan has from when I was a kid with a sticker on it and everything. I've been about this life. Sticker, that's a tag. Okay, well I ripped the sticker off earlier. So I've been about the value. this. So you're ruining the value. No, the sticker was like the sales sticker. Sounds like a lost value. No, the tag's still there. Look, it's even yeller. <laughs> um, and that's it for the cars, man. Back home, gonna chill, it's the weekend. Back to the grind. Hey, Hopefully y'all, my car folks, enjoyed it. We'll, we'll try to get more footage for you if you do. Hopefully the E30, what do you think, a year maybe? We'll have some cash and we'll make this thing beautiful. Get it wrapped up, tuned up, looking cute. Um, but I appreciate you guys for kicking it. Shout out to Matt for doing the help and all the dirty work. Silent Mike 3SB.co. Third Street Barbell. We'll catch you in the next one.